Maltese generally don't smell bad, but can have unique smells. Many factors can be the cause of your Maltese having a certain smell or odor. Some of the reasons for a smell coming from your dog can be a minor concern or may indicate something more serious, such as infection or health problems. That's why today's episode, we will share 10 common reasons why does your Maltese stink. Number 1. Accumulated Body Oil A Maltese body is constantly producing natural body oils that are released through the hair follicles. This helps keep the skin and coat moisturized. However, these have a unique scent that can be quite unpleasant once they accumulate. One of the goals of giving baths is to remove these oils and start again with a clean slate. So giving baths too infrequently than this can certainly lead to bad odors. Another aspect is that even if baths are done on time, if the shampoo that you are using does not sufficiently wash away the oils and instead skims over them, the oil and the bad smell will remain. This is a top reason why a Maltese can have an unpleasant odor soon after a bath. Lack of brushing can also play a role. Dead hairs that fall back into the coat can become caked with body oils, but brushing removes those hairs along with the oil that is clung to them. And brushing helps distribute oil from the roots of the hairs down toward the tips which can disperse the associated odor. Number 2. Poor Diet it is important to keep your Maltese on a good diet, not only to ensure that their health stays in good shape, but to keep any smells away too. Avoiding foods with too much corn or soy is best for keeping bad odors from coming from your pup. Number 3. Release of Microorganisms There are a number of microscopic microorganisms that live on a dog's skin and coat, including yeast and bacteria. Normally, these are small enough in number that it has no effect and there is no detectable odor. However, under some circumstances, this can change. If a Maltese gets wet from the rain or another source that does not include being washed with a proper shampoo, molecules in the water displace the smaller molecules of the microorganisms, triggering their odorous compounds. In other words, a Maltese will have that wet dog smell, which can make your nose wrinkle. Number 4. Flatulence Flatulence can be a big problem for some Maltese dogs, and the smell can be really bad. I am talking about the occasional flatulence which happens to all dogs, but I am talking about excessive flatulence in your Maltese dog. In most cases, the problem of flatulence comes down to the food being fed to your Maltese dog. Usually the wet food or soft food variety will cause more flatulence than the hard kibble. If you find your Maltese puppy has flatulence then try changing out the food for a week. It needs a while as changing food can upset the stomach of your Maltese dog before it settles down. Number 5. Ear Infections Ear infections can be a common issue in Maltese as they have teardrop ears which can trap the moisture inside. Ear infections will have a similar smell to a yeast infection and will be noticeable only if you smell near the ears. If you notice your Maltese puppy is pawing at its ears or is shaking its head, then you should check the ears for a smell. The best way to prevent ear infections is to ensure the ears are cleaned and that no water is left in them after a bath. If you suspect your dog has an ear infection, then take them to the vet to get some ear drops or medication. Number 6. Urine and Feces of course, Maltese dogs cannot wipe their bums and genitals after going to the bathroom, so it's no wonder that a puppy or dog can easily smell like urine or feces. And depending on the surface that dog pees onto and the force at which the urine leaves the body, there can be backsplash that mists the belly and slash or soaks into the coat. With feces, it is common for small bits to cling to the fine hairs around the anus. Number 7. Yeast Infection It is common for Maltese to develop yeast infections. These infections can be caused by multiple factors, including allergies, changes in their environments, exposure to humidity, certain medications, poor nutrition, etc. Number 8. Swimming Because of their long, silky fur, Maltese will hold more water than other breeds. It is important to dry them well after swimming 
or bathing to ensure that water doesn't stay on the skin or fur, this can cause an odor. Number 9. Your dog is scared. It's possible for your dog to emit a foul fishy smell from their anal glands, even if there isn't a problem like a blockage or an infection. It may simply be a part of their fight or flight response when they're frightened, anxious, or stressed. If your dog gets alarmed or scared, an automatic bodily response is to secrete the anal glands. Number 10. Dental disease. Dental disease in dogs can produce any number of foul odors, with a fishy odor being one possibility. Some dogs may have a genetic predisposition to dental disease, or dental problems may arise if you haven't been diligently taking care of your dog's teeth. The fishy smell might be especially apparent if a dental infection is present. 